In this video we will look at mappings. Suppose we have the function f of x is equal to root x plus x squared. Can we use all real values for x? The answer is no because we can't use negative values in square roots. Do we get all real values for f of x? And the answer is no because this function only gives us positive values. So we need to put in place some language that will let us study functions in more rigorous detail. Our first definition is the domain of a function f is the allowed values we can use in the function. So domain of f is all values permitted. The codomain of a function f is the set in which the values returned by f reside. So if I write f from a to b, x to f of x, what I'm saying is f goes from some domain to some codomain and some value of x to some value of f of x returned. So for example, this function is from the reals to the reals and x to x cubed. So f of x is equal to x cubed. I can use all real values and I get all real values returned. The image or range of a function f is the set of all values returned by f. So in other words, the range is all possible y values. A function is said to be injective, or one-to-one, -one, if every unique value of x returns a unique value of f of x. A function is not injective, many-to-one, if we can find an x1 not equal to x2, but f of x1 equal to f of x2. In other words, breaking our uniqueness. A function is surjective if the image of the function is identical to the codomain. A function is bijective if it is both injective and surjective. For this course, we shall allow the codomain to always be OR. In other courses, such as further maths, we will have different codomains like complex number C. Unless told otherwise, take the codomain to be OR. This is because our image is always something inside the set OR. Let's look at an example. State what will be the suitable domain and what is the range of f. The codomain is the reals or is f injective, not injective, surjective and bijective and our function is f of x equals 1 over x. Well this function can use all real values of x except for x equal to 0. Therefore the domain is the reals except 0. This function is injective since we can always have two different values of f of x for two different x values. I cannot make 1 over x1 equal to 1 over x2 if x1 and x2 are different because 1 over x1 equal to 1 over x2 by cross multiplying gives x2 equals x1 but x1 and x2 are supposed to be different. It is not surjective since the range is not or. Not every value of or can be made. For example we cannot make 0 so it is not surjective and so it is not bijective. I'd like you to try this one. Resume when you're ready to see the answer. So for this one our function is f of x equal to x squared and the question is the same. This function can use all real values of x therefore the domain is or. This function is not injective since 1 squared is 1 and minus 1 squared is also 1, so there's no uniqueness here. It is not surjective since the range is only the non-negative reals. Since it is not injective, it is not bijective. Since it is not surjective, it is also not bijective. That's all for this video.